The artists behind the Grail Tower charity single have been revealed after Simon Cowell launched the collaboration, a cover of Simon and Garfunkel's Bridge Over Troubled Water, this morning. With stars including One Direction's Liam Payne and Louis Tomlinson, X Factor winner Louisa Johnson, pop stars Robbie Williams, Rita Ora, and Emily Sand, and who rockers Roger Daltrey and Pete Townsend all lending their voices to the lyrics. The moving track has been trending on Twitter. All proceeds from sales of the record will go towards helping the families and loved ones of those killed, injured or made homeless by the Grenfell Tower fire, which took hold of the West London Tower block in the early hours of June 14. At least 79 people died in the blaze, but firefighters and police officers have warned that any more who are still missing are now presumed dead. X Factor Supremo Simon Cowell, who lives near the North Kensington site, told the mirror of his anger and upset over the tragedy, saying he had never felt so emotional in his whole career. It was this outpouring of grief that sparked his idea to release the charity single and he managed to set it up within 48 hours. Now it's been revealed which lines are sung or rapped by each act, thanks to eager fans who listened to the song when it premiered across radio networks at 8am today. Stormzy opens the track with a self-penned verse praying tribute to those who died and expressing his disbelief that this could have happened, then Robbie Williams kicks in with the first line. He's followed by James Blunt. Greg David, Dan Bastille, and Liam Payne, before they're joined by Melly Sand, Kelly Jones of Stereophonics, Paloma Faith, Louis Tomlinson, Labyrinth, and Jaw Smith. A second rap verse is introduced by WSDRN, then the voices of Leona Lewis, Jesse J, James Arthur, Roger Daltrey, Ella Eyre, Anne Marie and Ella Henderson and Louisa Johnson join in. The sweet tribute is finished by all the acts singing as one. Stormzy raps, I don't know where to begin so I'll start by saying I refuse to forget you. I refuse to be silenced. I refuse to neglect you. As for every last soul up in Grenfell, even though I've never met you, that could be my mum's house. That could be my nephew. That could have been me up there, waving my white plain tea up there with my friends on the ground trying to see up there. I just hope that you rest and you're free up there." Stormzy's sentiment was met with wide applause on social media, with many people saying he'd summed up exactly how they felt about the atrocity. Simon Cowell's star-studded charity single Raising Money for All Those Affected by the Devastating Grenfell Tower Fire was released on Wednesday. The cover version of Simon and Garfunkel's classic song Bridge Over Troubled Water, performed by the collective artists for Grenfell Celebrity Group, was given its first play across UK radio stations at 8am this morning. Its accompanying video will premiere on Wednesday evening on ITV before Coronation Street airs. More than 50 artists including One Direction's Louis Tomlinson, Liam Payne, Robbie Williams, the Who's Roger Daltrey and Pete Townshend, Rita Ora, Jesse J and Pixie Lot gave their time to record vocals for the fundraising track. Following the tragic fire at Grenfell Tower in West London, the record industry came together to record a single for the victims of the disaster, said Simon, who pulled the charity single together in just three days. Over 50 artists gave their time and support to make this happen. The track was recorded at Sound Studios in West London, just half a mile from Grenfell Tower. As well as raising money from sales of the single, X Factor boss Simon also set up a donation page, artistsforgrenfell.com, where people can contribute to the charity fund. This website has been built to create a donation page which, together with the money raised by the record, will hopefully encourage people to donate whatever they can to help those who have been affected by this terrible event. All donations made here will be used by the London Community Foundation to help those in need. Simon had asked all musicians who wanted to be involved to contact him, saying those who couldn't make it to the London recording studio could provide vocals over the phone. Explaining to the Mirror why he'd felt compelled to organise the single, Simon, 57 said, I felt how everyone felt when they saw the news. 
I was angry, upset, thinking what the hell do you do? It's not far from where I live, so when I drove up there, and you saw this tower, it wasn't great. And that's when you decide that maybe we could do something to help. You kind of think, what can I do? Do you donate some money and I was thinking, well maybe we could do a little more than that and that's how the record came about. Discussing the choice of using Simon and Garfunkel's bridge over troubled water, Simon explained that the track had appropriate lyrics for what the group wanted to do and he had just 12 hours to decide on a song. It is a great song to send out a message of support and once we decided on that, we had to get the artists, he added.